Good Monday morning. Well, I am standing along our, our lychee hedge. Uh, I've planted some mango trees between the lychees because the lychees have had problems. And the big problem recently was the lychee aranose mite. Uh, we had 31 lychee trees at the time. Uh, the Department of Plant Industry arranged for all of them to be cut back and treated for the mite. Uh, it looked pretty good, looked pretty successful. Uh, I did find some blistering on a leaf um, on another lychee tree, our big one near the house, and they sent that off for samples. I said, oh, you know, it's lychee scab. Don't worry about it. Well, this is something entirely different, and it looks like lychee aranose mite to me. Uh, of course, the nickname is lychee leaf curl mite. Uh, these leaves are curling, and they have this, uh, you know, underside of the leaves really developing a lot of icky looking stuff. So the Aranos mite in its early stages when it just starts a little bit of blistering on the leaf, it looks a lot like, the damage looks a lot like uh, lychee scab. But this definitely looks like the Aranos mite to me. Uh, I've contacted the plant I Department of Plant Industry, so hopefully they can get out here and assess it. Uh, this has been a really um, bad pest in Florida. Uh, it was unfortunately introduced on the west coast of Florida inadvertently, and it has spread all over. Uh, it's, I think, an insect that is spread easily by wind, and so anyway, if you do have a lychee tree and you see this on it, uh, try to contact the Department of Plant Industry to report it because they are trying their best to get rid of this particular pest.